Alrighty guys, so I thought I'd make a quick video on this just to give some of you guys a heads up and uh, maybe you should look for it in your printers. Uh, so I have the uh, Mono Price Maker Select Plus, uh, the newer one. This printer is only about four or five months old. Um, and the reason I was working on it here is my uh, thermostat thingy for the uh, hotbed isn't working and so it won't let it heat up. Um, I think that's due to this connector here, uh, being, uh, the solder joints being bad on it. So I'm going to take that off and re-solder it, uh, and see if that fixes it. But while I was in here, I noticed a few other things that I thought maybe you guys should check on your printers and make sure they're, they're okay. First of all is it looks like this pulley here is at an angle and it's rubbing the belt because it's leaving a pile of, uh, pile of stuff on the bottom of the plate. And uh, as you know, that's probably not a good thing there. So I'll have to figure out a way to fix that. And the other thing is over here, these wires right here were rubbing on the bottom of this pulley. Um, they were just laying on there and, and you know, the, as it was going back and forth, it would just start rubbing. And that eventually rubbed through. Uh, so I'm going to zip tie that down to this uh, point here and maybe remove this zip tie and like hot glue it or something down to the bottom so it's not touching that um not sure we'll have to see there but yeah just a couple little things that i've seen here that you guys should probably keep an eye out for and uh, just double check on your printers to make sure they're they're fine um also be a good idea to make sure all the screw terminals are tight um make sure none of these other uh connectors especially the high voltage ones and the high current ones uh, make sure that they are all soldered properly. Um, a bad connection joint has high resistance and can cause many issues. Uh, so yeah, just just something for you guys to keep keep an eye out on.